Cheers everyone, thanks for joining me today. I thought I'd put together this really quick tutorial to show you how to create this beautiful soft marble texture in Photoshop. Just a few quick and easy steps and you can easily create this design. Okay, let's get started. So first we'll go up to File, Create a New File, and we'll set our width at 1500 pixels. And we'll set our height at 1500 pixels. And resolution at 72 RGB color mode, perfect for web design. Go ahead and create our file. Okay, and basically all we're doing is taking two colors, merging them together, applying a couple of filters, and it'll give us that beautiful um, soft marble texture. With it, this tutorial, I'm just gonna use our default black and white foreground background so you can easily click there and default your settings we're going to add some color to this later in the tutorial okay so first step we come up to filter we come down to render and then we come over oops and then we come over to clouds and this gives us our base to work with now we go back up to filter come down to render again and this time we're choosing difference clouds. So it kind of starts to separate the colors and we see that marbling texture come through. We're going to take a lot of the light out of this, this image. So for that we're just going to go up to image, come down to adjustments, and we're going to click on levels. Okay, so it should bring up this window like this. And basically, I'm just taking the dark colors and taking them away. So I'm really going to focus on getting the lightness and a little bit of that marbling coming through. So I'm just going to click my mouse on this. And I'm just going to drag it right over to the end and just let it go. Because I'm going for that really soft marble look. This is, uh, this is the setting that I found that gives me that look. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and click on OK, and that creates that marbling texture. Okay, so the next step, we want to duplicate this layer. We don't have to go through this again. We can easily do that by just clicking on our layer. We want to right click, and then we want to click on Duplicate Layer. You can give it a name, but you don't necessarily have to do that because we're going to merge these layers layers together. So I'm just going to hit OK. And that gives me the duplicate of that layer. So a couple more steps and we're done. So with this new layer selected, we're going to rotate it counterclockwise. OK. So for this, we're going to come up to Image, or sorry, Edit. We're going to come all the way down to Transform. And we're just going to click and Come down and click on Rotate 90 degrees counterclockwise. And you'll see the pattern changes. If you want to see the changes, you can just click on. So we're just basically rotating that image. And it gives us another layer of texture to work with. OK. So now the next step, we're almost done. We want to reset this layer. So with this new layer selected, we want to change the mode, um, the layer mode. Right now it's set to normal. We want to click on that and we're looking for lighten. So we're just going to come all the way down right here. And we're going to click on lighten. And now you can see that the, the texture is really that soft marble look. Yeah, a quick, really quick and easy way to create this uh, beautiful texture. Okay, so we're working with white and black. Now we want to give it a little bit of color. We can easily do that as well. So I'm just going to, the next step, we want to merge these two layers together. So we're just working with one. We can easily do that by just clicking one layer, holding down the shift key, and click on it again. We got two layers selected. And now just right click our mouse, and we're going to come down to merge layers. And there we go. So then we have everything together in one layer. Perfect. OK, 
Okay, so then now the final step is to add some color to this. To do that, we're just going to come down and add an adjustment layer. So come right down to the bottom. I'm going to click on this little icon, adjustment layer, and I'm going to choose solid color. And that'll open up this box. I'm just going to, and we can choose any color we like from this, but I'm going to choose a really light color in this instance. So I'm just going to choose this really nice light color. I'm going to click OK. And you don't see anything, any changes yet. The only thing we have left to do is to change the layer mode for this particular layer. So we want to make sure the color fill layer is on top of our background. Okay, so that all looks good. So with that layer selected, we want to change the mode from normal to soft. So we're going to come all the way down. And you can see the, the change as you come down through. Because what I'm looking for is that soft light mode. Yeah, so now we, that gray, we want to turn it off. That gray and black. Now we have this really nice kind of rose gold texture marble look. Really pretty. Easy to do. And we can easily go back and change any color. I'm going to just click on this little box again. Double click. It'll open it up. And we got our color picker. So we can go through any of the colors. I'm just dragging my mouse down along the, the color grid. Yeah. The teal color is beautiful. And again, you can go a bit darker, a bit lighter. We have so many variations of color to work with. And a simple way to create this beautiful marble, soft marble texture in Photoshop. Okay, and that's it. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you today. If you have a question, feel free to leave in the comments below. Thanks for joining me. Until next time, bye for now.